Are you looking for the best curved monitors? In this video we will look at some of the best curved monitors on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. Dell Alienware AW3423DW. The best curved monitor that we've tested is the Dell Alienware AW3423DW. It's an excellent overall monitor with a 21 9 aspect ratio and a 1800R curve. Its QD old panel delivers fantastic picture quality as blacks look deep and inky in dark rooms thanks to the near infinite contrast ratio, and there isn't any blooming around bright objects either. However, it displays those perfect blacks only in dark rooms, as using it in bright rooms causes the black levels to rise. It's excellent for gaming, as motion looks smooth due to its near instantaneous response time. It has native G-Sync support to reduce screen tearing, which is great if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, as you can take full advantage of it. Even if you have an AMD graphics card and don't need the native G-Sync support, the Dell Alienware AW3423DWF is a cheaper alternative that performs similarly there are some downsides to monitors that use a QD old panel like this one. They risk permanent burn-in when exposed to the same static elements over time. It won't be a problem for most gamers, but if it still concerns you, a high-end monitor like the Samsung Odyssey Neo G7S32BG75 or the Samsung Odyssey Neo G8S32BG85 can be a good alternative in the same price range. They are both fantastic gaming monitors that get even brighter than the Dell, but they don't deliver the same perfect blacks. Number 2. LG 40WP95CW. If you don't need gaming features and need a curved monitor only for work, Consider the LG 40WP95CW, which has a subtle 2500R curve. It isn't as good to use in dark rooms as the Dell Alienware AW3423DW because it has a worse contrast ratio and worse black uniformity, but instead, it has a bigger 40-inch screen with a 5K 2K resolution that results in extremely sharp text. It has many productivity features that make it great for office use, and it comes factory calibrated which is important if your work requires accurate colors. Connecting it to your work laptop is easy because it has two USB-C ports with Thunderbolt for support. You can display an image from a compatible laptop and charge it with the same cable using the monitor's 96W of power delivery. It also has a few handy features like a picture-by-picture -picture mode so you can display images from two sources at once, like if you need to use your personal computer and work laptop simultaneously. Number 3. LG 34GP950GB. If you need something for both work and play and find the Dell Alienware AW3423DW too expensive, then the LG 34GP950GB is a good alternative. It has a 34-inch screen and 3440x1440 resolution, which is smaller than the LG 40WP95CW, so it has the same size as the Dell with a similar 1900R curve. However, with an LED backlit LCD panel, it doesn't display the same deep blacks as the Dell, but it doesn't have the same risk of burn-in, and it also gets brighter, which is great if you want to use it in a bright room. The LG has native G-Sync support like the Dell, which can take full advantage of your NVIDIA graphics card. Even if you have an AMD graphics card, FreeSync works without issue over DisplayPort. The gaming experience is great, it has a quick response time at any refresh rate for minimal motion blur. It doesn't have a backlight strobing feature to further improve the appearance of motion, but motion looks smooth even without one, especially at higher refresh rates. Number 4. Gigabyte M32UC. If you want something cheaper, a mid-range monitor like the Gigabyte M32UC is a good alternative to the LG 34GP950GB. It has a different type of screen than the LG because it has a 32-inch, 4K display instead of an ultra-wide screen. This means you don't get the same ultra-wide gaming experience where you can see more of your game at once, but with a high resolution, images look sharper. It's also a better choice if you want to game with a PS5 or Xbox Series XS on it, as it has HDMI 2.1 bandwidth that can take full advantage of the consoles. If you're a PC gamer, 
you'll be happy to know that it has a native 144Hz refresh rate, meaning you can play games at a high refresh rate without any problems. While its overall response time is fast and there isn't much blur, it has smearing with fast moving objects in dark scenes. Luckily, it has features you can use for gaming and productivity, like a dashboard that shows vital information from your PC and a KVM switch that makes it easy to switch sources and use the same keyboard and mouse. Number 5. Dell S3422 DWG. If you're looking for a curved monitor in the lower mid range price category, some good ultra wide displays cost less than the Gigabyte M32 UC and offer good overall performance. One is the Dell S3422 DWG, which is great for gaming and offers good overall picture quality. It doesn't offer the same 4K resolution and HDMI 2.1 bandwidth for console gaming as the Gigabyte but it's still a solid choice for PC gaming. The 1800R curve helps bring the edges within your field of vision, and it's 3440x1440 resolution and good pixel density deliver sharp image clarity. It also has native FreeSync VRR support to reduce screen tearing, but while it's G-Sync compatible, there are some issues with the G-Sync compatibility at lower refresh rates. Its VA panel offers a good native contrast ratio in dark rooms, displaying deep blacks with minimal blooming. However, there are some drawbacks to this panel technology, as it has narrow viewing angles and some black smearing with fast-moving objects.